the NFT space copied some of the worst attributes of the contemporary art world. Greed, speculation, the fact that whoever's the most popular or fashionable has the biggest market, which is very similar to like going to a contemporary art auction. Whenever anything is new or unfamiliar, it's human nature, it's a defense mechanism to push back, to reject. But I think that it's the role of contemporary art to talk about social, political, economic, and for me, the culture of technology, how technology uh, pertains to all of our lives. So I had this idea to have a book that's an open book that never closes. Because technology is, is changing in real time with such a rate of speed, why not make a book that never closes, that's always open? I worked with a company, Async, where I gave a lecture to this platform, and they have a dynamic technology. So I curated a group of 20 people to participate, writing pro thoughts of NFTs and negative thoughts of NFTs. And these people were disparate and included Krista Kim, who's a well-known well NFT digital art, crypto artist like Krista Kim, Sarah Mayohas, um, a group called Operator, two women that collaborate, making works together, Kevin Abash, and then people that would never do something of Hans Ulrich Obrist, the Swiss curator, and Jerry Saltz, the critic, the total of 20 people. And they've made initial contributions to this book. And then the book changes over time. So this part of this project will be exhibited during my exhibition called Slow Food. And people will be able to, to write on, on, on sheets of paper that will be present during the course of the exhibition. And those contributions that people will make with a pen on paper by hand will be scanned and the contributions will ultimately form part of the book. And if, like Duchamp said that art should have a shelf life of 50 years in a museum and then be chucked past its sell-by date. And when you think of an artwork, you think of like a photograph or a painting or a sculpture that radiates its artiness in a one-way conversation. And now with this new smart contract technology, the art that you own will actually transform over time. So it's all, in that sense, it's, it's a whole new definition of what art could be.